Good day, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to my home in Livingston, Montana. Okay, boy, it's been quite a day. I've been, I've got, what is it, 4 o'clock Mountain Standard Time. What is this, March 6th? Like if it matters, Mark 6th of 2019. But I've been sitting here today all day long for six solid hours playing Native American flute. I am just not kidding you. I'm about wore out. What it was is I got this bright idea this morning and I wanted to do a little improv. I had a little tune in my head. I, I wanted to do a... A little Native American tune for people who are sick, you know, people who are not feeling very well. I just couldn't pull it off. I could not. I have dug out some all my best flutes here and tried, tried. All I did was make one mistake right after the other, blowing sour notes and everything. So I gave me an idea, since I got my head clear up my derriere hair today playing flute, I thought, you know, make... Just sit down and make a short little video that might help somebody out with, you know, if you're interested in playing Native American flutes, which you probably aren't. Uh, you know, there's not a lot of people that are into this kind of a deal. But here it is. I put out a few videos, you know, in the past about how to play the flute and going up and down the minor pentatonic scale and all that other stuff. But here is one factor... When it comes to blowing on these glorified whistles, because that's what the, these flutes are, is really a glorified whistle, but air control, your the amount of air that's coming out of your lungs and going through your throat and out your mouth, your pursed lips, you know, because you want to kiss this flute, you know, you want to approach this flute with your lips like you're kissing it. Like that. No kidding. But here it is. Here, here now, now pay attention here. Because, you know, I'm I, I'm on the ragged edge. I've had a tough day. Just kidding. Relax. But your lower octave notes are down here. Okay, you have to blow a little bit softer on the on these lower octave notes, or otherwise you'll get a sour note. Trust me. And these notes up here on the upper register, you could blow a little bit harder. So. Trust me when I say that that the the amount of air that you're putting into this flute mean it, it, it means everything because if you get the right if you get the wrong pressure I meant to say wrong the wrong pressure through this flute if you're blowing too much air too much volume of air etc cetera, etc cetera, like I say you get sour notes so I'm going to show you real quick here. Okay, I'll try to do a proper, <laughs> I'll go up and down the minor pentatonic scale and try to do it correctly. The luck I've been having today, I don't know if I can do anything. Okay, now, I don't know if you could tell, but I blew a little bit higher, harder up here on these higher octave notes, these higher octave holes, if you will, and I had to smooth out or back off with my air volume down here. Because like I say, if you don't follow this simple little uh, air pathway or instructions I just gave you, you'll be blowing sour notes. Trust me, I know. I've... I've sat here for six hours a day, and that's all I've done is blown sour notes. Okay, now watch. I'll, I'll try to purposely blow sour notes. and uh, I blew a million of them today, trust me.
decrease in the air. See that sour note? Yeah, that's that's the deal. Straight up. Okay, it's just a, I'm not going to make this video very long because you're already bored. I already know that. But anyway, I just thought I would make a quick video for anybody that's struggling and, and do, do just what I said. They'll, you know, the, the best policy with any of these Native American flutes, I don't care who makes them or what, what key you're in or whatever have you, is just practice at first blowing gently. You, you, it, it's a lot better than getting carried away and blowing real hard. Okay, thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, take care of yourselves like I'm always infamous for saying, and we'll see you on Down the Trail.